Nissa sylvatica, the black gum or black tupelo, typically put into the Nisaceae, sometimes put into the Cornaceae or dogwood family. But probably one of the most beautiful trees in all of eastern North America during the autumn when its fall colors turn a beautiful range of reds, scarlets, purples, orange, and everything in between. The leaves on Nissa sylvatica are quite variable in shape. They can sometimes be top heavy or obovate. Sometimes they can be oblong or elliptical, sometimes nearly rounded and everything in between. So it's a difficult tree to describe the leaf shape. The leaf margin is very indistinct. There are no teeth along the margin, but it does have a waviness or undulate margin. The leaves are quite glossy. And then in the fall is when they really put on quite a show. This is a tree that's very common in swamps throughout the eastern United States, as well as on very dry uplands. It's a very small tree for the most part, although it can get to fairly good size. And even though the trees are often very small in the woods, they can still be hundreds of years old. This tree can live up to 588 years old. The bark is quite irregular on this tree. Sometimes it's very rectangular ridges with narrow, deep furrows. Sometimes the bark is every other type of shape you can imagine. The crown also has a very distinct form. It's a very pyramidal tree with really distinct perpendicular branches along the main stem. This makes an excellent ornamental for the landscape. It has no serious pest problems and it's very drought tolerant. This is Sylvatica, black gum or black tupelo.